Welcome back fellow Earthlings to my channel, Let It Go Junk Removal. If you're just joining in, my name is Austin Lee Hires, AKA the King of Junk. Thank you for uh, joining in today. And if you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and hit it now along with the notifications bell so you can get notified every time I put up a new video. Before we do the shout out, I'd like to just say, can you please hit that like button for me? That's all I want on this video is to hit 100 likes in the first 300 views. So if you viewed this video for the first couple of seconds, you've seen this, please hit that like button guys. And let's get on with the video. First of all, we're going to get the shout out of the day done. I'm going to put this one up and I'm going to put this one up. Thank you for constantly commenting on my channel and uh, getting a shout out. If you want to be the next one shout out on my channel, go ahead and comment down below. Just a couple of weeks ago, I put a post up on the uh, Trash Talk on Facebook. It's a group that Matthew Vick from Sonoma Strong Hauling created. I put a question up on there saying, how much do you guys need to make on a daily basis to uh, keep your business running in a flow? I said I needed to make $1,000. And some of you thought that that was way too much and outrageous. I'm going to go through some numbers. This is not even all the way down to the grind um, talking about numbers, but I'm going to give you some basically flat rounded off numbers that can show you and prove to you why we as a business our size need to make $1,000 a day or else we're going to be shut down. We're going to be making no profits. Um, luckily lately, and thank God we are so blessed because we've been making over $2,000 a day for like the past month, which is amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and go over these numbers and get started on this video for you guys. Don't forget if you like it, if you find anything helpful in this video, uh, just go ahead and hit that button down below, the thumbs up, make it turn white or blue, depending if you have an iPhone or Android. It really helps my channel out and the YouTube algorithm to make this video uh, search high in the, uh, in the rankings. So let's get on with the video. All right, so reason number one why we need to make $1,000 or more a day. Strictly, th this reason is, is the biggest, most cost-effective reason is payroll. I have Richard, I have Manny, I have my wife, and I have myself. Total per day that we have to put out is $370 per day for payroll. So that's already almost half of the $1,000 gone. That should prove to you right there why we need the thousand. But I'm going to go ahead with a few more examples to show you that we really need to make that thousand dollars to make any kind of profit. Um, reason number two is our fuel cost. We're spending on average about $75 per day. So uh, fuel cost is, is something that you're always going to have in business. But you have to take that and minus that from your, when, from your gross of the day because uh, then you can find out what you really profited. So let's minus that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put the numbers on screen right here. So that way you can kind of follow along while I'm talking. So we've got the 370. Uh, we've got $75 for fuel costs. Reason number three, the reason, uh, another reason why we have to make $1,000 a day is our workman's comp. We have workman's compensation and on average we're paying about $700 a month for workman's comp uh, and that works out to be about $25 a day. It's like 23.333 but I round it up. So $25 a day, we're gonna go ahead and add that on and minus that from the, the $1,000 that we need to make. Uh, number four, dump fees. If you're doing jobs, you're doing $1,000 a day in jobs, you're gonna have dump fees. Uh, so a minimum of $80. This is the minimum, guys. Minimum of $80 um, in dump fees a day. And actually, I'd say that's a good average because we do donate a lot and we, we keep our dump fees way down to keep that profit as high as possible. So let's just say $80 on average a day if we're making that $1,000 mark. Um, all right, reason number five, and if I, didn't, if I didn't tell you that was reason number four, the $80 average for, for dump fees, Reason number five, I put three, um, three reasons on number five. 
So it's uh, the company insurance, general liability, the truck insurance, uh, fully covered on every truck, and our Google ads. I put that all on number five, reason number five. And per day with all of that put together, uh, so uh, company insurance is only about $3 per day after you break it down. Truck insurance is about $10 per day after I break it down. And my Google ads, I spend about $70 per day after it's broken down. So total, um, when you add all of those things up, it's $633. So 1,000 minus $633 equals $367. Now, I'm gonna give you the sixth reason why we have to make that $1,000. Right now, we're at $367 profit for the day, and that's after minusing uh, just the first five things. So here's the sixth thing. I, I've told you guys that I make payments on my trucks and I make payments on my trailer still. So for my silver truck, it's $700, and for my money-making roll-off trailer, it's $700 per month. So both of those uh, divided out in 30 days is about $50 a day that I need to make. So now we minus that from our 367 and we've got $317 of profit for the day. I only have $317 profit for the business for the day after everything's said and done. And now these aren't even all of my numbers. I have other numbers that might work out to two, three dollars per day, uh, which will bring that down a little bit here and there. Like I said, lately we've been making around $2,000 a day, so our profit is looking a lot better than this. But this is the reason on Facebook, I said we need to make $1,000 a day to stay floating because that $317 profit per day is nothing. It's absolutely nothing for the business. If the truck were to break down, the transmission costs $3,000 alone if it's a transmission problem. It depends on what your problem is on how much that costs. So your profits could go right back into fixing your equipment just so you can keep going out and hustling. And I've had to do that from year one, guys. Year one, stuff breaks down, use all of the profit to fix everything. And I've built this company from scratch and I know what I'm talking about when it comes to saving money for, for profitability and holding on to it to make sure that you have the money to spend the maintenance on your trucks and trailers. I only pay myself $100 a day out of my $250,000 a year business so that I can make sure it stays running and all the money that is in the bank account for this business stays there and keeps being reinvested back into the company. I have a 1,000 square foot home, guys. With my garage added on here, it's 1,300 square feet. I have a nice backyard which allows me to park my dump trucks and my trailers and my dumpsters and I even have my office that I'm building back there. So I feel really blessed to have that. And if anybody can get a large piece of property out there, any one of you guys can get a large piece of property and run your business off of that, um, opposed to renting a place and running your business out of there, that is gonna save your cost a whole lot. So some people rent a place and they're spending money there. Me, I'm, I'm, I'm making sure I have equipment that lasts, brand new equipment. And yeah, I'm making payments on it, and I could probably pay off some of that equipment right now, but I like to make the smaller payments, and then once, once we're very comfortable and I can start making these large payments, pay them off so quick, that really that interest rate just go do, 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 gets knocked down. That's the way I like to do it. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to make that video about those six reasons why we have to make $1,000. I hope you guys learned something from this quick video and, uh, and you're having a good rest of your Sunday. Hit that like and subscribe button down below, please guys. It really helps me out.